All right, uh, Mr. Kramer, we are recording. Um, I got a, a, a few questions I'd like to ask you. Um, first, first, um, we need to get uh, driver to the Trailhead Tavern, please. Can uh, you pick it up somebody? Uh, they haven't called back yet. Picking up or dropping up? Uh, departing. Thank you. All right. So, so Mr. Kramer, um, actually, first, I guess, I guess we should get, get some introductions here. Uh, this is this is Brandon Kramer, um, all the way from is that Minnesota? Detroit, no, Michigan. Detroit, Detroit, Michigan. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, sir. So, Mr. Kramer, I think first off, what everybody's wondering is who is the man behind the teleporter? We see this this blue car around town. Massive fucking Fort Collins. Uh, you know, being the king of Fort Collins is not easy. But somebody's got to fucking do it, you know what I mean? And people oftentimes, they come up to me like, Kramer, Kramer, what's it like to own a limousine? I said, after you had it for a while, it's kind of like owning toilet paper. You use it when you need to. It's just there. It's just a, another utility product. That, this was a, a little nicer, of course, but the concept is still the same. That's a very great analogy, Mr. Kramer. Um, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wait, the, the other question, I mean, do you find yourself uh, feeling better than the rest of society? Well, what, you know, once you've been riding in the limousine. I think it depends on the community that the limo was in. Okay, that's, that's understandable. Um, what the, you know, liquor laws, and you seem to get drunk in this limousine. Uh, that's why I got it. <laughs> I, 